Hi, and welcome to my channel. This is KB. We're saving 101, and I'm KB, Kim Baker. If this is your first time visiting my channel, then welcome. I'm a lifetime thrifter turned reseller. Um, I currently sell on Poshmark, Macari, Tradesy. I send boxes into ThreadUp. So if you are interested in reseller tips and tricks and lots of haul videos, then do me a favor and consider hitting that subscribe button down below because someday it may help me out. Um, <laughs> today is my favorite day of the week. It is a thrift all Thursday, which means I have gone into Goodwill and become a personal shopper of unique items that are no longer available in stores. I save them from landfills and I resell them for profit. Uh, so we're gonna dive in and take a peek at what I got. Um, first off, um, I have had a lot of new subscribers, so thank you. Um, I do wanna say that when I go into my Goodwills, I actually use the ThreadUp app to check out items, and I do that for to figure out their actual um, price point. Um, I don't use the Poshmark app. And um, if ThreadUp for some reason doesn't have it, I will Google, but yeah, that's how I do things. Um, and I divide my haul up between what I'm going to currently list and my selling platforms, or on my, sorry, on my selling platforms, and what I plan to a box up to send into ThreadUp. Um, I usually do like to pick up about 50 items. You know, it takes two items usually, and all of that then is profit. So <laughs> really super easy. I keep it really super simple. And we're going to dive in to see what I got this week. All right. So I'm really super bummed about this one. Now, um, my Goodwills actually allow seven day returns. So I may be taking this back. It's gorgeous. I love the print. I was going to send it to thread up because it's a Calvin Klein um, and it's this mock wrap dress in this really super cool um, print with beautiful colors. And I apologize, I have false lighting on because it's cloudy outside. Um, but yeah, uh, I missed the fact that this one does not have a size. So it's either list it in my closet or take it back and receive a store credit options. All right, there we go. I got my first whoops out of the way for the week. Now let's see. Hopefully I didn't get any more. All right, ah, I'm stuck, I'm stuck. It is really jam packed. Uh, sorry guys, it's not that big. It, well, it's a good size haul. <laughs> it's like 56 items. All right, uh, let's see, this is a time and true. It is an extra large. Um, it is like this lace um, boho carnigan. Um, I'm sure it probably was like an intimate, does it even say? I don't care if it was or not. I'm going to list it under Carnigans and I think it should do very well. It's a nice large size. It is a beautiful maroon color. Sorry, the color's not really showing up that great. Um, and yeah, so I think that should go fairly quickly. All right. Oh, by the way, I have all my links down below. You can follow me on Instagram. Check out my closet, my Poshmark closet, my Macari, um, and all that good stuff. So don't forget, it's all that down that below. And if you like this video, give me a thumbs up. Anyway, um, this is uh, Zena Outfitters? Zena? I don't know. You guys, I slaughter the names all the time. There you go. Outfitters, size medium. Um, it actually is really super cute. It's just this pullover, lightweight knit, really short sleeve um, top in this like leopard print and gray. And I may try this one on. Although I don't do good in short sleeves, so, and it's a medium. If it was a large, I know it would fit because I got really broad shoulders. All right, <laughs> I'm gonna keep moving along. This is Dana Buckman, a size large. Um, oh, I absolutely love this. Um, it is really super pretty. I love all the animal prints that are going on. There's like multiple within there. You got some zebra, you got all kinds of, you got some like a reptile and some leopard and all that good stuff. But um, yes, I'm gonna list this in my closet. It's gonna be too big. All right, next, 
All right, I have no idea what brand this is. I will have to Google and see if I can come up with a brand, but um, it is the super cute bodycon dress. And it has, of course, everything. You got your little cup details. Um, it's kind of like an uh, illusion because it gives you like a thinner look, having this be the lighter, more focused area, and this being a little bit on the darker side. But I thought this was just too adorable to leave behind. I know, and I don't like picking up things that I don't have the info on. It does have the size. Which size is it? It's a size large. And let's see, I can tell you. So if you don't know, there's an RN number, and your RN number, if you have it on your items, you can go to your RN textile lookup, which is like your clothing, and you can type this number in. It's 80742. And I can find what company, um, you know, does this particular brand. Sometimes you can figure it out, sometimes you can't. Oh, another really good tip is if, um, it, and it doesn't matter what phone you have. If you go to your Google part of whatever phone you have and you go to your Google Photos and then there's like this little, I think there's either an I or there is like a circle with a dot in the center. You press that button on one of the photos and which I will do for that item and it does a search and comes up with items that are similar or maybe your exact item. So that's a really quick way also to look up your item. Just a little FYI. All right, um, this is a Forever 21. This is a US size 3X and it is this like, oh, and the purple, it's not It's not coming out really pretty. Um, it's more of a reddish purple. It's gorgeous. It's like this faux suede 80s, um, almost like uh, moto jacket. But um, yes, it is gorgeous. It is really super heavy, um, which you guys, when you saw on multiple platforms, I feel bad for anybody who buys on Macari, who is a larger size, because yeah, this will be more than $10 to ship. It'll be at least 10. I'll have to weigh it to find out. But yeah, at least at Poshmark, it's always going to be until five pounds. That's $7.99. So just, you know, if you're shopping and you have larger sizes you're shopping for, you know, Poshmark might be a better deal for shopping on. Um, all right, this happens to be a uh, cotton blue. It is a size small and it's just this really super cute like boho leggin, except that it has like this, um, I don't know, it's not crocheted. I'm blanking on the name of the material. Anyway, um, with this little ruffled peplum. So um, I will list this. Uh, let's see, this is divided and it is a size four. I just thought this was kind of uh, cute. It's, <laughs> uh, I don't know, maybe it's very parochial, uh, but anyway, it has like, you know, the little tie here. Um, it has, hmm, I don't know, it does have like a fit and flare feel with this A-line part of the skirt, long sleeve, the sleeves are sheer, but yeah, I thought it was adorable. Don't ask me why, but um, yeah, I, I'm hoping it's gonna do very well. Um, that particular brand has been hit or miss for me. Okay, this is Cache, one of my favorites. I do love picking up. This was a uh, mall brand, funky, um, like, <clears throat> yeah, going out kind of thing. And you can see it's got um, some beaded detailing up and through here, uh, some actual drawstrings and it's like a three four sleeve uh top and what size are you size small so um and it sorry and it's a cold shoulder can you see that it's a cold shoulder so um i'll list that in on my selling platforms all right i had um a pullover hoodie that was this material and it sold within 24 hours on makari so how could i pass up this like pullover hoodie, long sleeve, uh, <clears throat> kangaroo pocket. This is so super soft, um, like dress. Um, now it does say nightwear on it. Uh, sleep Zanista, never heard of it. Um, I picked it up for the style and because the last item that I had that was similar sold instantaneously. So um, I am gonna be listing this and I, I will probably list this under um, not only the nightgowns, 
but I'm gonna list it under dresses and maybe even under hoodies. So I do go through and list under multiple um, categories. You just have to remember to delete multiple categories when an item sells that you've listed them in. Anyway, I think one of my favorite things to do right now is to go through and um, like I had a bunch of Poshmark sales. So I got to go through and delete all of my Macari listings. And I was just like, yeah, you missed out. Yeah, you missed out. <laughs> Does anybody else get excited doing that? I do. I'm sorry. <laughs> all right. Anyway, uh, let's see. I don't know. This is... Um, I say I'm not going to pick up vintage, and then I pick up vintage. So I lie a lot. Um, but you know what? I just sold a vintage piece again. So, you know, it is what it is. Um, this is really super cute. I love this. Um, I don't know. Kokomo? I think it's Kokomo. Um, and it's really super faded, but it is like a paper tag, and it says medium. Um, and it is this tie-back waist um, V-neck with all this ruching, some crochet detailing, and just like some split angel sleeves that are only three-fourths so yeah just or a bell whatever you want to call it um with this flowy part i like that flowy part because it hides the well. anyway i'm gonna list this one all right i got this purely because of the fact that it is a nautical theme and there's anchors so when somebody googles anchors um yeah i will have an item that will pop up immediately and so that's why I picked it up. Uh, let's see, it happens to be an Express Extra Small and it is this belted shirt dress. Um, and it's really super lightweight, cute. So yes. <clears throat> and I really thought about passing this one up. Maybe next time I will. Windsor um, formal and it, but it is this really super cute fit and flare with this illusion neckline here and um it also has uh an illusion in through the waist uh fit and flare in a halter style so yes and what size are you hopefully i have a size medium size medium okay i keep saying i have to pick up more of the casual stuff so i did i picked up a uh, dry uh, no a tech gear dry tech size medium and it just has like this little side ruching on one side I thought it was like a knot um, it's really cute so hopefully I don't try that on because <laughs> we could all use a little more loungewear couldn't we um, <laughs> all right uh, this is a brand I really haven't picked up before but I couldn't resist the color of this um, hello there's my tag it's wet seal extra small um, and it's in that mustard yellow, perfect for fall. Um, really super cute, short sleeved, kind of like a fit and flare. It's really super soft, um, almost, yeah, it's just, it's really, I thought would go very well for the season. All right, don't ask me. I should have put this one back, but I didn't. This is, say what? <laughs> and um, let's see, it's an extra, no, not extra, it's a size small, but it is this long sleeve, like tunic, ombre knit, um, mock neck, sleeveless. I could put on dresses and also sweaters. So, um, but yes, I love the ombre color to it. It is nice and soft. So I'm hoping that'll do very well. All right, super cute, so cute. Uh, let's see, what size are you? Would I try you on? Uh, probably not, size small. Yeah, I think my shoulders will be a little too big for this one, but um, who are you, who are, da, 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 heart and soul. And um, I just love this super fun, like raincoat and it is belted. So, although I know trenches are more in, this one will sit just below your hips onto your thighs. So um, I think that's adorable. All right, this one I got just for the print of it. <laughs> Look at this. Oh my gosh, we are talking, I'm telling you, 70s psychedelic um, glow in the dark, 
I don't know. I'll have to actually use a blue light and see how much. I mean, yeah, I think it probably glows in the dark. Um, and look at that. It's just gorgeous. I thought it was so fun. So it's a little swing dress. It's by Joe Star. I've never heard of them. In an extra large. It does have a paper tag. But I don't know. I've never heard of this brand. Um, so I will Google. I didn't care. I picked it up just because of how funky it was, which I love to do. All right. Whoop. Okay. So this is Lemur by Nanette Lepore. Now, Nanette Lepore has a much higher end line and she's worth a lot of money. This one um, isn't necessarily worth all that much, but again, it's a long sleeve, a button down, extra large, and what I liked, I thought it was had a fun detail. It's got this crisscross um, peekaboo back. So, and I love the colors. I love the print. And yes, that'll be listed. Okay, so it's baby fat. Never picked this brand up before. Size medium. And I don't think it's made of anything. Uh, let's see, acrylic and no. Nothing spectacular, but it is in this like red. I have to Google it. Might be tartan, Scottish tartan plaid, um, with some metallic gold um, detailing, and it's got these puff sleeves, little crop. I thought this is just absolutely 100% adorable. Um, I'm gonna put that for streetwear. If you guys like funky, you gotta really check out my closet because if it's funky, I love it. I do. All right. <clears throat> This is uh, Disney, um, and I don't even think it has the brand anywhere, but we know it's Disney. Uh, let's see. Do, what do we have in here? Da, 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 da. Fabric content. And so this will require for me to take measurements. Um, I'm sure I have no idea, but it's, um, it is Alice in Wonderland um, with like the Disney castle so, uh, you know what? I really, it's going to sell. It is. Um, Disney, <laughs> I will pick it up. Next, Harry Potter. <laughs> this is a Harry Potter and it is a size small. Um, let's see, does it give any more information on this one? Uh, no, it doesn't give any more information. So I will go through and Google and check out to find out which, if this is like hot, no, well, if it's, um, I even forgot. Jeez, it's been so long since I watched the videos. Anyway, um, which house it was that um, would wear that. Anyway, keep moving, keep moving. All right, uh, this one happens to be Cloudless, and I've never picked up Cloudless. And I believe it is a little cocktail dress. Um, I left a divided shirt that was almost exactly like it. Kind of polyester size, a medium. And let's see, I don't know if I would wear one of the cocktail dress, but well, I guess it goes to my short length, but I'm like one of those people, I guess I would have to wear some very thick, um, not thick, but um, some funky leggings with it so that in case I did bend over, I, do, I just, yeah, I got issues. I don't want my tushy hanging out, <laughs> but yeah, so I'm going to list this under dresses. I just love, it's like this really pretty silver um, pleated material, metallic, so all those good keywords, party, girls night out, little black dress, blah, 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 blah. All right, I have not got a chance to look this piece up. I think, I don't know, I don't know what I'm thinking, but it's super well made. Um, I think it's from the 80s, but I have not done any research whatsoever. So um, I'm, I'm lying when I say I think, well, I personally think it's because of the uh, print, uh, the texture of the material. Woo. Um, and okay, so it is, who are you? Um, Greery Rourke Camisdato? I don't know. So I have not looked it up. I was in love with it, and that's why I picked it up. So um, I'll find out who this is. And, um, but yeah, I thought he was great. It's a size eight. And it is this like, I don't know, I would Hawaiian island um, dress. It does have pockets, 
um, back zip entry and it has a really pretty kind of sheen to it sorry it's not really picking it up so it's not really doing it justice but it's gorgeous so I don't know I mean just the way it's made I'm like that's like we had drapes that looked like this in the 80s I swear to god um anyway yeah I, I will google and figure out if it's going in my closet most likely I'm less like thread up like values it like outrageously high okay wait I just got snagged okay ah push all right it's not gonna fall over that's for sure okay um am I getting into my question marks I might be I'm no I think I'm still I might list these all in my closet I don't know we'll see this one happens to be what who are you oh ecot from like American Eagle Outfitters I think size medium and just this like little swing dress so I might actually send this one in this one I believe I'm listing in my closet because I don't think I'll get very much for it and what I like to use thread up for guys is I like to use thread up for items I'm going to get more money from I like to utilize them as they are listing items and I don't have to do all the work for it um, so yeah I do things a little bit differently I don't I, I do purchase items just to send into them but um, like this piece because it's got such a boho flare and it has all this embroidery on the sleeves and like this I don't know if you want to call that crochet detailing or lace detailing whatever um, it's just a Christopher Banks it is a 1x so it's a great size it's a great look and I think actually it will do I will make more money selling it on my platforms so that's why I will list it there and not send that in all right this is a torrid and it's a size 24 and it is this this is the front so it has this big keyhole Mm, peekaboo cut out and <laughs> it's a sleeveless like little fit and flare in this cream on cream can you see that detailing I don't know if you can see it looks like it's dimpled it's it's got like a textured floral anyway um, and it has an illusion back neckline with a keyhole cutout and exposed zipper um, I'm thinking I might send this one in not quite sure all right I don't know how does this color look on me uh, my daughter is getting married next year so um, I don't know I might try this one on this is connected apparel size 10 it is this really super pretty uh, draped scoop neck sleeveless and um, in this like stretch crochet lace ruched detailing um yeah I may have to try this one on I don't know how well that color does for me though anyway uh, so yeah that one I might oh I did this one gosh guys I'm sorry it's cloudy the weather dudes get to me so I'm hoping to get through this all peppy and fun so hang in there by the way I do love to save my favorite items for last do I even have a favorite item this week I don't even remember I do have a favorite item so um yeah I have a few um we'll get to them all right and nothing like last week you know that you really unique piece ah love that one all right so this one is intro size small and it has tags navy intro dress um so I'm going to and it is like new it's like never yeah so I'm going to list this one in my closet and I don't know can you see it's got this shark bite handkerchief um, and it's this swing I think it's gorgeous it's really nice and lightweight um, I believe I'm listing this one in my closet band of gypsies I believe I'm listing this one and it is this really super cute um, it's got like this little flutter sleeve a little bit of a fit and flare it has a bunch of different detailing you can see like that lace with that little ruffle on the bottom um, 
what do you call this top? All right, I'm blanking. I'm just off today. But again, you've got that uh, detailing here. See that? So, um, yeah, I'm going to list this one in my closet. I think that should do very well. Woo! This one has some perfume on it, I think. Oh, got a whiff. Whoa! All right. Uh, mm. All right, this happens to be a Talbot's, and it is a size 20. They are a stretch, and they're a little crop pant. Um, I believe I'm going to send these in. I don't know. I haven't decided. Large sizes do very well for me. Of course, large sizes do very well, period, guys. So uh, I do have a hard time saying, okay, I'll just let them do it because I only am going to get mm, here or there. And, but it is what it is. I am trying to let them do more work. Um, anyway, all right. Watch my thread up videos. I do those every Tuesday with um, an update from what did sell for the week. All right, moving along. This is um, Fleet Street Petite. Say that fast three times. And it is a size 10 petite. It is this fully lined flannel. So you can see there's the zipper lining. Um, trench, it is quite heavy. Trenches are very much in. The thing of it is, is that even on Poshmark, I believe this thing weighs more than five pounds. So you know that's going to cost you extra in shipping. I will debate on whether I'm sending this in or listing it on my own. Um, so even though it's heavy, I think I might list that one on my own because it's heavy going in and that takes up more room. <laughs> Uh, I don't know. You'll have to wait and see. Super cute. Trenches are super in, guys. Um, all right. This one I am sending in. It's a Chico's. It's like this jean jacket. Yellow in pristine condition with all of this little lacy boho kind of detail and your, like, little grommets. So I will send this one in to them. I have not sent this brand in, so I am going to try to send this in. I don't know if it comes up green. It's green. It's a really pretty green in this. Okay, wait a second. Um, <laughs> I'm going to keep going because it'll come to me. And I know, I know, I know, I know. I did this last week, and it's not the whorehound. It's not the candy. Uh, oh, my gosh. And I had it before. I got that in my head. See? Okay, anyway, we're going to keep moving along. <laughs> Um, but it's a Raphael, and it is 60% uh, wool. So I'm going to give this a shot and send it in. It is a little bit more of a um, single-breasted, three-down button, you know, uh, a little bit more of a boxier type fit. Not super, but so I think that should do well. I will see. All right. Surprisingly enough, I was going to leave this item behind. But when I Googled it, I said, okay, I'll take it. Um, this is Edge. I've never heard of them. And what size are you? Oh, God. Can I even read that? I think it's a large. I think it says large. Do you have another tag? Oh, I need glasses and both. Yes, large. So it's a large. And it's not a made of anything spectacular, but they do value um, their tops quite high. So, um, and of course, it's this like high low. Um, and it has a keyhole cut out back with um, the buttons. So I think that's adorable. And because they value it nice and high, I am going to send it in. All right, I haven't decided on this piece. Um, I, I have sold Tiny Bahama in my closet. So um, the, I think these are really super cute. These are a size 12. They're 97% cotton, the rest stretch. Um, little crop pant inside, yeah, 12. I said that um, in this print. So I haven't decided if I'm going to send that in. I'll probably re-Google to see how much they value it for and what the payout possibly could be before I decide. All right, I believe I'm sending this in. This is a two-piece, which I paid $1 for, which is phenomenal. I love that. Um, so they're 50 cents each. Um, anyway, this is Alfred Angelo, and it is a formal. It is a 24W. Okay, wait. Now the trick is, see, this is what happens. Maybe I'll have to list it in my closet. Last week I had a, oh, a really good brand. So this one does not have the size on it. Okay. Wait, 
What is what are you? Way over here in this corner. All right, I've never seen a tag over here. Let's check out what this tag says. What the heck? It's over here. Are you? It's already been cut out, so there's no info. Or was that a... No, sorry, guys. That was just the little strappy straps. But anyway, it's a 24W. And yes. So, butt up always separates them. Oh, oh, sorry. 28. No. US. 26W. Wow. Okay. No, 24W. <laughs> All right. So it is a 24W. Okay. Again, I verify it's a 24W United States. Um, <laughs> sizing. All right. Anyway, uh, here we go. It is this uh, tank, beaded tank. And, um, and are you silk? Ugh, yeah, like I can read. Polyester. 100% polyester. Um, and it's camisole. So I was planning on sending that in. Now, they will definitely list the tank. Because there's no size on the cardigan, they'll probably send it back to me. Even if I was to list them separately in my Poshmark closet or my selling platforms, I always put that there is a matching item available within my listing until I no longer have a matching item. And then I remove that little part of the saying. But I could list those separately and do it that way. Or I could put them together. And ThreadUp's not going to do that. So it looks like it might be in my closet. Anyway, moving along. Uh, is this toss face? What, what the hell? Sorry. All right, it's a size medium. Um, uh, they value this particularly um, pretty well. So, and I love this ruched, gathered, hide that tummy, uh, <laughs> v neck, stretch, three, four sleeve blouse. So, yes, I'm sending that in. All right, I'm sending this one in. This is Vertigo Paris, size medium. They value this brand nice and high. And this is a gorgeous, look at all the detailing on that sweater. So yes, guys, I send everything. I send all kinds of, I just don't send lower end items, which I'm thinking about doing, who knows? Um, but yeah, this is super cute. So this is definitely going to them. All right, this is a Kenneth Cole Reaction, and it is a size two. I'm going to send this in. And it is like this, I don't know. Look at this, it is so, I'm like, it took me a while to even figure out how the heck to wear this. I'm like, does it tie in the back? This is a really long tie. But yeah, it's got like this peak hole, and yeah. And just bizarre. It's really kind of bizarre, but I'm gonna send it in. I think it'll do better there. Funky print. Do you have pockets? <gasps> and it has pockets. So yes, did I say the size size two, right? Yes. And I think it's mostly cotton. So, um, but yeah, I'm gonna send this one in. I think it's adorable. Hopefully the person can figure out how to wear it. Okay, Harvey Bernard, and it's by Bernard Holtzman. So when I look up things, you do want to look up everything. So of course, because Harvey Bernard has his has one, and then this one says by Bernard Holtzman. So it's a different price point. Now, there's only one thing wrong, and that there the beads on its button are coming off. So I think I'm just going to remove all the rest of the beading. Um, and uh, but yes, it is like I would call this a smoking jacket personally and we'll see how it does. And what size are you? 16W, fantastic size. All right, now we'll see. This is a weird piece and I picked it up because I don't know. Um, it's got that 70s flair. It's Oscar Pila, perfect leather. It's, I mean, it says perfect leather, but it's not made of leather. And um, it's a size small with that 70s flare faux fur um, collar and all of this detailing. So I thought it was kind of cute. Um, definitely, you know, for anybody into the 70s, this is like a trendy kind of thing. So um, I plan on sending this in and seeing how it does. Now they have rejected a leather Oscar before. So 
anyway, we'll see. I'll send it in a few times. Um, I send the same item in a few times, and sometimes I send um, different items in by the same brand a few times just to see. And, you know, it's trial and error. All right, this is Mata International, size medium. They value this brand nice and high, so I am going to send in this open knit, um, like, scoop B, plunging scoop B, a 3-4 sleeve, a sweater. All right, I swear to God, this was like the surprise. <laughs> surprise! I'm going, okay, just like there was an other piece that I'm like, oh, okay, well, they really value it that high. Okay, I'll take it. Um, again, I was going to put this piece back. It's Julie Brown NYC, size small, but they value this brand extremely high. So, because they value it, and when I say extremely high, they value it over uh, originally a $60 value. Um, I think it was even 80 to 100. So, um, yeah, I'm like, okay. Those are the price points I do personally like to send in because I get a bigger, better payout. And we'll see. All right. Uh, this is Boost Boost and Michelle Bonnet, size medium. And it is this super cute, like, in pristine, brand new looking crop jean jacket. Thought that was freaking adorable adorable um so <laughs> um in a medium so i am gonna send this in um i found another harvey and again it's the same this one is 100 percent linen and it is a size 12 so i'm going to send this in yes there you go Okay, Studio M. This is 100% silk. It is a 1X. Again, and it's got this little tie back. So um, they value this high. I'm sending it in. I'm debating. I might not send this piece in. I might keep this piece in my closet. Um, it is an INC International Concept, extra large, but it is this really super cute boho with this metallic kind of um, detailing. Uh, just yeah i think it's adorable i just need to see what they value this towel top because you know short sleeves sleeveless sleeveless gets really low values on quite a few items so yeah i want to go through gosh guys ooh, sorry um <laughs> didn't mean to be doing that um and see where the value is before i send it in because if i'm only going to get a couple bucks then i will post it in my own closet so, um, okay, I'm getting down to, I should move these around a bit. Okay, yeah, I'll move these around a bit because, there we go. All right, <clears throat> this is Narna, I don't, I don't know what that, Kamisi, is that Kamisi? Um, anyway, it is, it says two, so it has its own special sizing. I take it, but they valued this person really high. Made in Italy, and that's all it says. It doesn't tell me. Um, I don't know. I will have to Google their tags because two might be part of the branding because it says it on the other tag. I don't know. It's I don't know if it's the size or not, but it was just this white button down only because they valued this so high. Did I pick it up? Okay. So yeah, I'm Googling. I'm going seriously. I was going to put that one back. Um, all right. This one I'm sending in. It's less, it's inexpensive. It is a candies extra small, but it's new with tags. For what $58 are you? $58. So I'm gonna send that in just because and see how it does because I personally would not pick this up for my closet. It's new with tags. I have seen that candies has sold decently and they've gotten some good dollars for it. So I will give that a shot. All right. This one is a Chico's size two. This little like 70s rick rack boho flare kind of dress. Um, yeah, I'm gonna send this in.
I'm going to send in this Ann Taylor Loft factory size 8. Oh, now that I saw that it's factory. Ugh. I, who knows? I will look and Google it if it's not worth me really. But, you know, they do pull a lot of stuff. It has this ribbon tie back. So it is really super cute. I think it's 100% silk. If it's 100% silk, that will help me determine because, of course, silk is going to get a higher value. Hello. There it is. No, not there. Nope, it's 100% polyester. So I will Google this again. And I'm going to put it up front. That might have been a boo-boo. We'll see. Because I do like to send in higher valued items. All right. I am going to give this a shot. This happens to be a motherhood maternity. It is a size small. And, yep, I'm going to send some maternity in to see how well it does and what they've price pointed at. I really didn't Google all that much, but I figured for a dollar, I could not really lose out that much. Right. And that one this week's, I can't even remember. Guys, I put this on the same rack. I think that one is this week's, okay. <clears throat> all right, this is Boost Boost, again, size four. Um, I thought this is adorable. I love the colors. Um, it's got a little 70s belt. It really has like that Southwestern um, and it's got the braided little belt going on. Uh, I think it's adorable. So I'm going to send it in if I don't try it on. Isn't that cute? Ah! All right. Keep moving. Stay focused. All right. I did pick up a lot of coats. Um, all right, so these are like, okay, we'll get this one out of the way. This happens to be a Power Down series, Free Country, and Free Country 2X. Um, I don't know if it's made of anything special. I didn't even check what it was made out of. Uh, do not check it. Blah, blah, blah. Faux fur inner, polyester, polyester down clusters 50 percent down clusters um and the other is water fowl feathers so anyway it does have the word down um and so it's a nice large size i am going to send this coat in um i will brush this little fur guys when i send things in you know like if i was listing this in my own poshmark closet i probably wouldn't brush the fur. Um, I list it as is, you know, matted fur, whatever. Um, I'll just take a little brush and fluff this because what I really want are all my items to be listed like new. If it's not new with tags, I want it to be listed like new. There you go. All right. Moving right along. Another coat. Oh my gosh, this one's really super heavy. Um, and this one happens to be new with tags. Well, I consider it new with tags because I have buttons. Um, it's Metro Style 14 tall. So it is a special sizing. We'll see how it does. I have, it like attracts like every single piece of fluff. And I swear some, it must have got dragged on the floor or something because it's got fluff everywhere I've got to get rid of. But um, it is a wool to the floor. I mean, all the way. I'm going to look at the ceiling. Hopefully. I mean, it's all the way to the floor. It touches my feet. And I'm 5'4". So, um, floor length, wool blend, coat. I'm sending this in. Oh, right there. Okay, there we go. <sighs> All right. So, I'm getting to some of my fun pieces, my unexpected pieces. Okay. I'll just keep going. So, let's see. This happens to be Max and Cleo. They value... This brand pretty high. It is a 12 ugh, petite. Really am trying to stay away from, but I just loved how pretty this coral, um, flowy. Sorry, I must have put you back towards the ceiling again. Um, <clears throat> it's just really super pretty. 
So I picked this up. It is a halter style. Um, and yes, we'll see how that does. Now that I read that it's petite, it probably, I don't know. Ugh. There we go. I did another whoops. Okay. All right. Never have picked up this brand. Peter Martin. It is a size 14. It is 100% silk blazer. Um, it has like that little bit of a Western feel with this um, exposed seaming, but it's just a single button down. So yes, I'm going to ascend this then. I'm trying to narrow it down guys, cause I am to all my favorites. Okay. This one they value really high. It is Jared Daryl. Jared Daryl. I think that's how you say it. Um, size 42, which, you know, I'd have to Google what a size 42 um, goes to. But it is, and leather is supposed to be really super big. So it's got this leather, and I think it's all faux, leather belt um, in this double button or double, yeah, double button, single breasted, um, like knit blazer. So yes, I am going to go through and give it a shot. I will go through, there are a few pulls in through here, so I will remove those and clean it up to it's hundred percent. Also, it has that faux leather. I, don't, I should look because maybe it's not faux leather, but, um, cuff detailing. Let's see. Are you, do we have acrylic polyester oh it is a wool lane spandex nylon blah 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 polyurethane so no it's it is a faux leather detailing but it does have a wool blend to it so i'm sending this piece in okay <sighs> so I saved my funky ones for last because funky's always my favorite. All right. <laughs> this one is gorgeous. I love this. It is, I don't know if you can even, do you see the detailing? Oh, so it's like a velour with, I don't, I can't remember the name when you, I always have to Google things, guys. Senile. I'm going senile. No, I'm just kidding. Um, Ralph Lauren, well, Lauren, Ralph Lauren, size 12, and it is 18% silk. So it is a silk blend. And, but it is just this gorgeous green, um, long maxi. Well, actually it's not a maxi. I lied. It's not a maxi. It's like, well, it depends. For me, it's very close to being a maxi. Um, for a tall person, it is not. Um, it does have a little bit of a gather for a little bit of a back. Do you see that? Um, how it just hangs there. Can you see that? Um, and so I plan on sending this piece in. Okay. All right. Another dress to send in. And I do like to send my formal dresses in. I usually get paid way more, way, way, way more than if I was to sell them on um, my selling platforms. So yes. Now, of course, you always have the, the risk that they're going to be returned um, because they're usually a higher price point. But you know what? I've had plenty of those sold and have stuck. So that's why I like to send them in. Um, this is an Adriana Propel, and what size are you? Okay, U.S. size six. It is this fully beaded navy, and with the silver beads. Look at this. I mean, we are just talking uh, moonlight sparkles, uh, <laughs> and it has an adorable back detail, which is this. I don't know. You can't. All right, we'll see if I can have it this way. Okay, if you can see how it's got this like, um, like a little, uh, I don't, what do you call it when they pin up the butts to the ladies? Um, bustle, it has a little bustle, even has a little bustle button. So it has like this little bustle effect on its booty, which is just adorable. So yes, I'm sending this piece in. Gosh, that one's heavy. Okay. All right, we're almost done. So thanks for hanging in there, guys. Don't forget, give me a thumbs up if you like it. Oops. Hey. 
up here. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. Um, so this is one of my favorite pieces because it's so funky. I do believe you can wear this uh, reversible. And just look at that. And they value it over like $120. Um, really super cool. Um, what is it? Esther? S S I don't know. Can you see the brand? Hold on. No, you're not going to be able to see it. My lighting stinks because it's Jackie outside. Oh, wait. There, can you see it? All right. Anyway, I believe you can wear this both ways because it has pockets this way. And when you have reversibles, guys, your info is usually in your pockets. It's actually called a magic, it's, oh, the Magic Scarf Company, Esther. And then it is a small to large. So because it has so much stretch, I guess, to it, I don't know. But can you? I don't know. I think it would be, although you'd have this big Esther thing on your back. But you, otherwise, you have it in your pocket. So it's probably not reversible, but it looked like it was. I love the print to it. And with the collar, uh, with the collar hanging over, I think you could wear it reversible. Ready, set. I just don't think there's any pockets this way. So if you wanted this really funky kind of crinkle down thing, just in black, let's see, you'll have to tell me, I think, oh wow, and it really is quite big. Um, but yeah, I don't see the name to it. But there's just no pockets on this side, and it has the funky color. Um, and the zipper is nice because it's big enough where you can zip it this way, and then you can totally flip it over and zip it the other way. So, yes, two for one. Now, I've noticed I have sent in items that are reversible, and they don't even list them that way, but hopefully the person figures it out or knows the brand and knows that they make those types of things, and yeah, who knows. Anyway, um, I love it. Like I said, it was valued way over 100, not way over, but, um, and so I thought, okay, I'm sending this in. All right, this is a very funky piece, and I just love it. And this is nothing special, but it's just so funky. Sorry, guys, I've got things falling everywhere. Uh, <laughs> you heard that noise. Uh, this is Chico's size three, so it is a really good size. And it is this duster, and it is beautiful. And I definitely think I could sell this within my Poshmark closet, but um, Chico's goes pretty high. Actually, when it's a regular Chico's, it goes really high on there, so... I am going to send this in and see how well it does. And it's gorgeous. It's gorgeous. So I was ecstatic about that find. All right, and my bust find, we'll see. I haven't sold any of these pieces, but I'm gonna send this one in to right up. It is soft surrounding. It is a size medium. It is this really super beautiful boho um, oversized tunic, split collar, um, very ethnic, yet floral it's and it's super soft and it's new with tags for 120. um so and it's a size medium so i am going to send this piece in so yes all right so there you go that is my haul for this week <laughs> i really appreciate you staying and joining me i hope you come back to see me again um don't forget thumbs up thumbs down any questions and until next time guys